Yeah, Joel, just a nerve wracking day for the staffs of both Senator Tillis and Bud. I've been in touch with a few of them. We're in Washington today, as well as members of Congress. And thankfully, as you said, this does seem to be resolved at this point. But here was that message uh, that gave the all clear this afternoon to the staff of the House and Senate from the U.S. Capitol Police. It reads, quote, all Senate buildings, the USCP has cleared the internal security threat incident return to normal operations. And from the video that we saw out of Washington, Washington. This afternoon, it was anything but normal as staff had to be evacuated out of the Russell building. This is at First Street and Constitution Avenue. This is where Senator Ted Budd has his office. Senator Tillis is in the Dirksen Senate building right across the street. The senators themselves are here in North Carolina, but staff members for both senators had to shelter in place, locked down for hours before they were escorted out by Capitol Police. Federal law enforcement officials tell ABC News that they were concerned about this kind of action, which is called swatting because of some online chatter. House members told me this afternoon that their staff was also locked down, sheltered in place, but the all clear was given and they have resumed to just normal operations. Joel, though, certainly more security patrolling both chambers of Congress this afternoon, and you better believe for a few days after that. Back to you. Yeah, those office buildings, Dirksen, Russell, Hart, they are massive buildings. Lots of people work inside, yeah. and I'm sure a lot of frazzled nerves there. Josh Chapin for us at the Federal Building in, in Raleigh. Josh, thank you.